Praxis Prepper. Hey YouTube, this is Praxis Prepper, and I may well be dead right now. I'm pre-recording this video before I go to Yellowstone at the end of May, between May 28th and June 6th, which already happened because I'm going to schedule this video to release after that. Uh, I'm going to be at Yellowstone, and if it explodes during that time window, I'm very likely dead. So, goodbye. It was fun, you know, whatever. Uh, so, I, but the reason I'm doing this video isn't just to like, you know, like haunt you. Uh, it is because I, while I'm there, uh, while I was there, uh, it's kind of weird because it's the future for me, but it's the past for you. Uh, I'm recording videos when I'm, I'm over there. I'm, I'm, I'm sure content will come up. I'm not sure exactly what they're going to be about, but I'm going to record stuff there. It's a beautiful place. I want to share that with you guys. And uh, I'm just giving you a heads up that that content, if I'm still alive, is, uh, is headed your way at some point. It's really important to get out and still do stuff, even though there are dangers in the world, and there are plenty of dangers. I mean, if, if there weren't, we wouldn't really be prepping, because why would you prep if there wasn't anything to be concerned about? But it's also important to like get out and live your life and everything. I think a lot of people are under the, mis well, sometimes it's the correct impression, but it's usually the mistaken impression that preppers just hide in their basement bunkers all the time and don't do anything. We love to get out, you know, it, being aware of a danger doesn't mean that it has to cripple you and like handicap you and prevent you from you know getting out and living your life you can choose to do that but you don't have to at all and we're going to a giant super volcano that has been acting kind of strange lately there have been a lot of earthquake swarms a lot of new geysers erupting that don't erupt that frequently you know maybe it's headed for an eruption but i mean honestly it could be another thousand years before it does it anyway so we're not going to hide in our basement bunker. We're going to get out, live life. And if we survive, I'll be sharing some of that with you guys. So that's it. Thanks for watching. And I hope you guys enjoyed the upcoming Yellowstone content, if I survived. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.